Hello everyone, back for a second box of Heritage Miners. Uh, let's try this out, let's get into this. Oops, almost killed myself right there with this knife. <laughs> this blade is so dull. Um, but yeah, Heritage Miners, the cheapest hobby box you can get. Uh, but I think it's a great value. Uh, talk a little bit about prospect cards uh, while we do this break. Pretty interesting set. Uh, I opened the box pro debut as well for 2020 and uh, looking through the cards, you know, there's so many recognizable names of guys who will be in the, you know, our MLB players, the younger rookies, second year players, and guys who are about to, you know, likely get spring training invites and start the league off in the minors and be up in the league up in the big show so you know same thing with this you might not know the names of the players who come out of minor leagues heritage 2022 but in a couple of years you know a lot of these guys will be in uh will be in the majors so just a box topper three cards benny montgomery james wood john kenzie Knoll. james wood this is a prospect i i've it's a little buzz i've heard but i don't know too much about them so i'll do my research my homework it's kind of what i do with these players kind of what's good about this product um you'll get to know the players uh the names of the uh rookies to kind of look out for uh you know when they do get called up to the big some guys fly under the radar a little bit as well um you know you, you'll forget about them it's like oh hey look they got called up and um you'll see a lot of familiar names Lots of some names of rookies. So, yeah, try this out. See what happens. Sella Meyer on the front. Number two pick by the Braves, or by the Red Sox. 2021 draft. Um, but, yeah, we'll see. Um... You get one number parallel per box or so. I think that's what I calculated. Uh, Ian Lewis, Tristan Cassis, ooh, autographs. That's right, they are face up. Jackson Merrill, okay. Mm, let's see if I can pull up the prospects, but shortstop prospect. Padres. 1903, so he's 19, young player, high school player. Um, did he get traded to the, um, I know C.J. Abrams went to the Nationals, but I don't know, Padres, uh, they, they make a lot of moves, so hard to keep up with their minor league system, Maximo Costa, I don't know, John Kenzie Knoll. So yeah, same guys you're going to see in, um, Something like Bowman Draft. Um, the other one. Bowman Chrome. And then Bowman Base Set. Um, just imagine that they are, these are all like the, anything that doesn't say Bowman first. So, kind of similar. You're going to see a lot of, um, you know, big name prospects. Clint Kowser, Jeter Downs. Marcelo Meyer. Kind of the... Uh, out of the gate, the top prospect in uh, Bowman Draft. Colson Montgomery. He's got some buzz. Tyler Black. Oswald Peraza. Reed Trimble. Riley Green. Riley Green, a rookie. Uh, he should have... Did he have a rookie card? No, no. He should be a rookie next year. 2023. Uh, probably Series 1. Adley Rutschman. A few others. Um, Michael Harris, Jose Ramos, Mizell Urba Urbana, Jose Miranda, Nick York, uh, Esteban Machado, Joe Gray Jr., Luis Gonzalez, uh, and Drew Ellis. I've noticed that four teams seem to have just a ton of prospects. I see Red Sox, uh, Orioles, Diamondbacks, and the Rockies. It's like 
have all the prospects in the major leagues or something. Uh, at least according to these sets. Um, Tristan Cassis, Red Sox. <laughs> uh, okay, insert. Wildered Patino, 73 tops. Cool card. Insert. Isaac Pacheco. Peralta. Yeah, Oswald Peralta. Warning Bernabelle. Benny Montgomery, another one of the uh, 21 draft class. Uh, on card autos, I think, are pretty awesome in this set. Just the fact you get two. Um, these, this, comparatively to, say, something like Bowman Draft. You know, these boxes are so cheap. You could get a case of this for the for the box for the price of like something like Super Jumbo um, Bowman Draft, Cameron Colley, Benjamin Bailey, Ronnie Marie Show, and so it's got some color. So green coming up. This is Trey Sweeney, Tampa Tarpons. That's I just, that's that's a team name you don't want to mis mispronounce. <laughs> you could easily make a Freudian slip. Tarpon. Okay. 17 to 75 there. Nice little color card. Let's see. Hopefully we'll get another one. Uh, Lauver Piguero. Brett Batty. Ellie Dela Cruz. He's a big hot prospect. He's been shooting up that prospect list uh, with the Reds. So hopefully we'll see him pretty soon. Uh Austin Kendrick, Trey Sweeney, is that the same, no, not the same pack, was it? The base card and the parallel, was that the same pack? I'm going to have to go back, I'm tripping about what that is. Um, I've had this weird thing where it's like, yeah, if you see the base, if you see a parallel, the base card is not far behind. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, that just happened. Nick Prado, uh, I know he got called up this year, so he might be in Series 1. Alex Benetta, Benellis, Pedro Panetta, uh, internet, um, pretty big name international prospect. I know the, uh, probably the ace paid a ton of money to sign this guy, I think. If I'm not mistaken, I'm thinking the right guy. Vladimir Guerrero Sr., that's a cool one. I like that. Ethan William, Ethan Wilson, Ezekiel Tovar, Jose Rodriguez, Brian Bello. It's another Red Sox prospect. I swear, I think 10% of the checklist is Red Sox. Feels like they have so many players in um, that get printed in these sets. Um, Diego Cartaya, that's a nice one. Francisco Alvarez, Henry Davis. This could be a nice, really nice card. All the best catchers right now in the minors. Um, yeah, I like this card. I'll have to look for that, put that to the side. I wonder if there's a prospect outfielders, or might have to look and see if these cards a little closer. You know, something like I think there's a Magic Bird. Who's the other guy on that rookie card? Out of 81 tops. Something similar to that, I'm thinking. Uh, Eddie Leonard, Zach Fien, Robert Half, Luis Matos, yeah. Outfielders. Uh, JC Carrera. Prospect. Okay. Denzer Guzman. Nelvi Martin. Marte. Austin Martin. Bubba Chandler. Go pretty fast for this box. Oh, see, oh, about halfway through already. Okay. Like my pace at these breaks is uh, starting to increase a little bit. So, oh, yeah, get through this a little faster. But there's nothing wrong with taking a little time to enjoy the cards, you know. Uh, Hedbert Perez, Luis Matos, Taj Bradley, Brady House. He's another prospect. I've seen his name a little bit more lately. Um, I think he's shooting up the list, but 
So I have to go and look at look for that guy a little bit more. Learn a bit a little bit more about him. Okay, Matthew Liberdor. Triple A ERA average leaders. Four. Four point four six. So looks like guys scoring the minors a little bit more. Gary Bell Angeles. Spencer Torkelson. Jonathan Clace. Um, yeah, he's already um, definitely in the majors. He has his rookie card, but you know they highlight a little bit in the uh, minor league highlights. I like that. Kobe Mayo, J.C. Perea, Jordan Groshans, Anthony Volpe, top ten prospect. We'll see. I mean, um, Yankees, Cody Morissette, Benny Montgomery, Keone Cavaco, Marco Luciano. Okay. All right. Uh, Everson Artiaga. Federico Polanco, Henry Mendez, Austin Wells, Gage Workman, Carson Williams, Noah Miller, Jose Miranda. Um, I've noticed a lot of bigger names, though, are the short prints in this set. The short prints come out, I think it's one per six pack, so something will be... A little wary, something like you know, you're getting three of the top prospects, but uh, that aren't in the, the main 200 card base set. Um, you'll know just there's a higher number or high number uh, sharp prints. So we'll go through the, the pile, pick those out later on. Uh, Tyler Soderstrom, Matt McLean, Justin Foscu, Colton Kowser. Um, Adley Brutch and Ryan Spikes, Tristan Cassis, Michael Triana. Let me think about this. Eight times. Is it 18 packs? Yeah, so. Um, what's the math on that? <laughs> Hold on. Okay, let me, let me think about this. So eight times 20, 160 minus 16. So. Um, 64 times 2. So, okay, there's another black card back there. So, 128 cards minus about, I don't know, 10 or so special cards. We got about 118 cards, base cards, about half the set. Uh, your chances to pull any given player, probably about one in two boxes, I'm guessing. Uh... But with the short prints, you know, I think that's like a 20 card checklist. Your odds are about one in every six to seven boxes. Brandon Howlett, Roberto Campos, Pedro Leon, Dari Lorento, Sal Frelick, Alejandro Pai. Yeah, one in two boxes for any specific player in the base set and one of them yeah so that's how the short prints are comparatively how rare they are um matthew Liberdor. but yeah if you give me a chance or a decision to buy yeah one box of bowman draft uh let's let's even just go with the regular jumbo what is a jumbo like 500 bucks something ridiculous like that or 10 boxes of this <laughs> Man, we're breaking 10 boxes of Heritage Miners. We're going to get 20 autographs out of there. Probably get a lot of the same names. Um, just a good, um, from a, um, value perspective, this is, a, I think, the better choice here. All right. Got a few more packs here. All right. Um, Pedro.
Pedro Panetta, Corbin Carroll, Elijah Tatis. Ooh, yeah, Ellie De La Cruz. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, 208. Yeah, that's a short print. The high number there. Ooh, okay. Hot prospect right now. Uh, as many of the cards of his cards, I think you can get. Um, you have the chance, yeah. I think um, I think he's gonna be pretty special. Yudi Cape, Jordan Viars, Alejandro Pai. Yeah, I'm happy about this one. Very nice short print. And I'll go ahead and put this in a uh, top loader. Okay, last four packs. One of these should have an autograph, we'll see. Melkar Perez, Yoki Cespedes, Jordan Walker. Cespedes again. Uh, Warmoth, Beavis. George Village, Jerry Jason Dominguez, Benny Montgomery. That's a pretty nice one. That one has potential. Dustin Harris. Okay. Eduardo Garcia, Lonnie White Jr., Daryl Hernandez. Ooh, oh, too fast. Milkar Perez, Modesto Nuts, third baseman. Um, yeah, we have to go look that guy up. Pretty decent looking autograph there. I think these autographs are better than the um, the Bowman Chrome, at least the. Uh, I think this stock takes the ink a little bit better, so um, autographs are pretty nice, actually. Francisco Alvarez, Brainer Bonacci, Brett Batty. Alright, two autographs. That's uh, pretty good. So, Christian Santana, Dalen Lyle. Two non-pitcher autographs. Also pretty good. Maximo Acosta. I've noticed with um, stuff like Bowman, Bowman Draft, man, you can get you know, either three autos and get three pitcher autos. It's pretty brutal, especially for the uh, prices you're paying. Uh, Cesar Preto, Brian Roccio, Pete Crow Armstrong, Jay Allen. Um, but yeah, maybe they need to find a way to. Uh, publicize the pictures a little bit more, make them a little bit more collectible. I mean, otherwise, there's only a handful of pictures I think that are, you know, just the amount of strain they put on the pitcher's arms. They're so um, prone to injury these days, uh, especially when, you know, a lot of these guys are trying to throw gas. You know, 98, 100 mile an hour is not uncommon these days. Davis, Michael Toglia. Oh, there's a Derek Jeter. That's pretty cool. Yeah, Derek Jeter. Very cool. Max Ferguson. All right, Ernesto. Alexander Ramirez. Alexander Mojica. All right, let's go look for the other short prints. Just be a matter of going through these real quick. Looking for any card over 200. This one. Yeah, Brain Bello. Um, these black borders on the back are pretty. Um, Very condition sensitive. That's one thing about this particular set. So, something to note. 
So kind of taking my time a little bit. You know. Man, I've seen some breaks of some super high-end stuff. Oh man, the way that they treat the cards that is pretty rough, Jack. Um, I think how you treat your cards. Uh, I think I'm clumsy, and uh, sometimes I mishandle my cards, but I try as best as I can. Colson Montgomery, okay, that's my other, probably my third one there. We'll just check real quick. I'm not um, able to go and look through this and see if we have any short prints, but it's possible we missed a vintage stock or a photo variation, something of that nature. Sometimes I'll put like action and a little baseball symbol by the number for those types of variations. I've seen that. Um, so I'll have to go look at cardboard connections, see like what the, um, you know, how to identify those. But it's usually the serial code on the bottom. Um, but I'm not going through that on video or camera here. But these are some pretty nice uh, short prints we got here. Uh, Colson Montgomery. Brady House, Ailey De La Cruz, that's, those might be the top three on that in the, in the checklist, so, just by that alone, makes it a pretty good box. Let's up the, look up these prospects real quick, um, see how they're doing. Jackson Merrill, rounder Padres top prospect uh, let's do the uh, baseball top 100 prospects yeah there's so many prospects uh, it's hard to keep track so um, eventually the names get pounded into the back of your brain, but yeah, it's good to check. Alright, Jackson Merrill. Alright, um, so he's San Diego's last um, remaining top 100 prospect. Number 83 on that list. But he is a high school player, so he's got a lot of time. So, I think this is a really good one to get. If you got something like this out of Bowman Chrome, or Bowman, as a Bowman first, you know, that might be a hundreds, hundreds of dollar card, but we're happy to pull out a Heritage for a fraction of the price. And, um, I think it's a nice looking card. On card auto. Can't go wrong with that. Okay, Melkar Press. I'm a Nest of Nuts. I think that's what the uh, Giants. Sorry, just checking real quick. Or am I wrong? Got another team. Could be a different team. Uh, ECL Mariners. Oh, the Mariners? Hard to uh, remember the affiliation of all these uh, minor league teams, but we'll just check real quick. Milkar Perez, rookie player. Number 18, Mariners, Prospect. So, you never know. You never know. Um, happy to get those short prints. Those are pretty nice. Uh, Jackson Merrill, a Padres uh, top prospect right now as of this video. So, good to get another good prospect card. And this guy, you never know. Young player. All these guys. Just a matter of... Um, you know, who's going to show out and 
I'll make it to the show. So yeah, pretty happy with this. Pretty good break. Um, yeah, two autos. I think you can't go wrong with uh, Heritage Miners, and um, this card design. It's better than the the ones that we've had in the last two or three years. Uh, classic design. So yeah, um, definitely. If you see this stuff, I would just buy it. Uh, can't go wrong at the fifty-five, fifty, fifty to sixty dollar price range. And um, that's it. That's box number two. Box with uh, box number three in a bit. Thank you for watching.